Hi everyone, welcome to Steamport. My name is Sandy and today we're going to be learning how to create your own turtle at home. Turtles play an important role in coral reef ecosystems when they're responsible for maintaining seagrass bed health and also helping shrimp, lobster, and fish populations in these ecosystems. However, coral reefs are currently at risk due to climate change, global warming, and ocean acidification. And this causes corals to lead to coral bleaching, which makes them look white in color. The materials you'll be needing for the sea turtle project is green pom-poms, glue of any kind, green acrylic paint, glue on eyes, a carton of any kind. I'm using a juice carton, but it's preferably that you use an egg carton and cut it out. A pencil, a paintbrush, a pair of scissors, and lastly, green construction paper. So we had to cut out legs for whatever box or juice carton that you decide to use, and we will be cutting them out in the size of petal shapes or a waning crescent moon, as you can see here. And then once you have your legs cut out, we will be painting our box, or if you're using an egg carton, green. And make sure that you have a specific surface to put it on so that if you do spill anything, your counter surface will be fine. And the green that we are painting the turtle also shows how there are plant cells in corals called zooanthellae. And this is where we will be attaching the eyes to our head for the turtle and gluing them on. So since they're tiny plant cells, the zooanthellae are the reasons why they give them color in coral. So when there isn't zooanthellae, this is when these coral tissues become almost transparent, and which is why they turn white. And so after you're done attaching your eyeballs to your turtle head, this is when you'll attach them to your carton or the body of the turtle. And usually this coral bleaching is caused by water that is too cold or too hot, if there's too little or too much light, and if the seawater is being diluted by fresh water. So once your turtle head is glued on, this is where we'll take our legs that we cut out before, and we'll start gluing them onto the bottom of our turtle. And again, like I mentioned, these turtles are here to help the coral reef ecosystem and help maintain the ecosystem. So even while corals are going through coral bleaching, this wonderful turtle still helps to save the coral reefs. I hope you all enjoyed creating your own turtle at home. Thanks for coming to Steamport and make sure to check out steamport.org so you can find more steam activities to do at home.